This diagram depicts different wiring configurations for ballasts. The simple objective when converting your fluorescent lamp to LED is to remove the ballast and connect the line or hot wire, usually black, and the common or neutral wire, which is white, directly to the lamp holder's terminal connections. With LED lights, polarity matters. Don't attach the line wire, also known as the hot or live wire, where the neutral wire should be. With the power disconnected, remove the old fluorescent light bulbs. Remove the ballast cover and remove the ballast along with the lamp holders connected to your ballast. Remove the power wires connected to the ballast by removing the wire nuts and then place the wire nuts back where they were. Once the ballast and the connected lamp holders are out of the fixture, clip the wires coming out of the ballast. The ballast is no longer needed. Now, the jumper wires on the power side must be cut on the lamp holders and attached together so that the neutral wire and the line wire will be supplied to each lamp holder in the proper polarity. Note, because we're using LED lamps that are powered from a single end, known as toggled, we are only wiring one side. Add any additional length of wire and connect together with wire nuts. You can see here that we have a line wire from both the right and left lamp holders connected together with an additional length of black wire. We did the same for the neutral wire, white. Now reattach the lamp holders and connect the line and neutral wires to the lamp holders using the wire nuts. Attach the ballast cover. Install the new LED lamps, making sure that the power side of the lamps are on the power side of your fixture. Clearly mark your fixtures as converted to LED with a marker or sticker. You can use LED converted fixtures on the same power line as fluorescent fixtures. Our conversions took between 12 and 15 minutes per fixture. Each converted fixture was reduced to 18 watts, down from 32 watts, but we actually gained better light. Shop around for your LEDs. We paid $5 each on eBay.